Hey, this is uh, Luke, the other half of Rod Bent Fishing. Lexi's currently in the bed with uh, the extracurricular activities that she has to do during the summer right now. Uh, but anyway, we plan on doing some bank fishing for catfish later this week if it doesn't rain, which I'll mention later in the video again. But anyway, we're making these uh, easy do-it-yourself rod holders with rebar inch and a half PVC and number 28 stainless steel hose clamps. Um, you got that kind of stuff sitting around the house. These are really easy to make. I'll show you what I did in a minute. So what I got here is some half inch rebar. Uh, these are ones that are 18 inches long. I didn't feel like cutting rebar because that just takes forever and I don't have the proper tool for that. And then it's inch and a half PVC. I bought a whole stick up in case I want to actually make some uh, PVC ones for, for sand fishing off the surf. Um, so these are just cut four inches long. And then what we're doing here is the number 28 hose clamps. Um, these are stainless steel, doesn't matter. I just bought stainless steel, but um, anyway, two of those hooked onto there. Um, so I just used my saw and chopped these into four inch long pieces. I have a little bit of the edge of the rebar protruding that way when I get the hammer I can hammer them down and not damage the PVC. Um, these just use a 8 millimeter uh, socket style wrench or flathead. I just chose 8 millimeter because I like using the, the ratcheting portion. Um, but anyway, slide them on. We have to loosen these uh, number 20 inch hose, 20 inch hose clamps. You need to loosen them up pretty good to get them to slide in but once you tighten them down you have plenty protruding out of the end there and um, I mean they, these are secure I did not over tighten these hose clamps here so that gives me a good bit to shove down into the ground with the little end of the rebar protruding out past the PVC so I can hammer on this and not damage the PVC up um, I just I need something because we were going to go do some uh, bank fishing for catfish here later in the week Hopefully, as long as it doesn't keep raining every afternoon. But um, anyway, grabbed all this stuff from uh, Lowe's Home Improvement or whatever hardware store you want to go to. But um, yeah, once you have your pieces here, just going to loosen these out a decent amount. Grab two of them. Slide them on out. I slide one on the PVC. Push it out, bend it on through like so, like I said let it protrude out a little bit so you have that tip to hammer on. The same thing here, if you feel that it's too complicated to get everything over, slide it on the PVC first and go that way, let me put it on the right way here, I guess I like them both hanging the right side there. So same thing, just uh, Slide them on like so. Then tighten them down. Like I said, I did not over tighten these at all. I mean, they, they keep snug, snug. They're not going anywhere. I saw some things online where guys were using quarter inch rebar. I went up to the half inch. I'd rather like to know that it's not going to bend and flex when I have to try to work it out of tough ground. But anyway, there's your final product right there. We'll give them a shot later this week. Hadn't been out in the boat here lately. It just keeps raining and I don't feel like getting caught up in this crazy weather that we're having currently here in Charleston. So there hasn't been much uh, going out recreational on the boat, just riding around. There hasn't been that much fishing either. Love to get out there, but really just don't want to get caught up in the weather.
Oh, there you go. Set of four for the family to go out and have something to hold their rods because when you're catfishing, they're not going to sit there and hold those those rods the whole time. I, I know that, so especially the kids. So that'll help them out, and that's pretty much it. Got any questions? Uh, leave a comment. Uh, if you like this, go on and hit like, hit subscribe. I appreciate it. Hopefully you'll see us out there in the boat catching some fish here shortly. Thanks.